Well, there's my setup. I'm gonna, you can see my camera here. Back behind that, you can see another tripod. It's not usable. I forgot the little ARCA plate that goes into the bottom of this camera that I'm holding in order to mount it on that tripod. So I don't know how I'm gonna do video here. But I'm set up on the side of this hill. If you look to the right, I don't know if you can see it, but there's a game trail that shoots, a very small game trail that shoots. You can see it start to the right corner of that tree right there. And it comes around behind me and drops down here. And if you look, I have the window open, you can see there, I'm going to have to fold those flaps inside so they're not flapping around. But uh, I can shoot from three different directions. Um, and I'm going to use my camo knitting and everything else that I can to make sure that I'm not seen. But if you look right, I'm having a hard time seeing it on this camera. Oh, uh, right about in here. There's a limb, I can't see it on the camera, it's too small, but there's a, a root that goes down. You can see where they're coming down to the water. Here, you can see trails where they're coming down. So I'm hoping that being down here close to this water something will come along looking for water I also hear birds so if I get in the tent or the I'm sorry the the blind soon enough and settle down I might get birds as well it's probably 1 30 in the afternoon but I need to be in that blind and still for a while so wish me luck there's the view that I have look excuse me my crab corners quarters rather I don't know if they're gonna see me through these windows I'm, I've got my camouflage netting on and I'm hoping that that'll be enough that if I move real slow and I'm real careful they won't really see me we will see this might be a a blown trip if it is I'll post it anyway and we'll just you guys can just come along with me as I learn how to do this. I think that I picked a good spot. I have folded my camera legs in so that they are, it's more like a tripod. That gives me a lot more room in here and a lot more maneuverability in this small one-man blind. But I mean, I think I might be too close to the water. If I get anything big like a deer or something that comes down to the water, I won't be able to get full body shots. But that's all right. I'll do close ups. The problem is if you look, you see that mess of trees and stuff, how close everything is. I'm not going to be able to get clear open shots. I'm going to have to get pictures of them moving through the brush, assuming I get anything. 
that's not ideal. But I kind of like shots like that because it shows them moving in a natural environment. A natural environment. I'd love to find a nice, fat, happy bear rolling around here. That would make my month. I've kind of got, the more I think about it, I have this set up a little bit wrong. The sun, it's past two in the afternoon. And the sun is going to set that way. That is west. Um, it's got to be because that's the direction that the sun is setting. And there's a nice shot of the creek all the way down. into the sun. But now, if I turn this way, that's out of the sun. The sun is aiming that way, so I would get like uh, a golden hour light in that direction. But you can see how thick all of that is. There ain't no way I would get a decent shot, so I'm going to have to take what I can get, but the next time I set up, I'll set up, see I set up long ways this way, front and back, so that I would have plenty of room in here for the tripod and everything like that. The next time I set up, I'll set lengthways side to side because these windows are wider and they would give and then I would close that side window open this window open that window and open this window I'd have the three directions in that way that I could shoot but a long window here yeah. it's going to take some learning I'm good with it that's not a problem well, I didn't get much of anything. I saw a, uh, like a young turkey over on that side, but part of the problem with today and part of the reason that I came out thought I heard something, was to uh, test out this blind and I learned a little bit too late that I actually want to be sitting facing a corner so that I got double shot out windows, both windows. Um, when the turkey came into eyesight I could not get my body turned around to where I could get a shot on it. So, but thanks for coming with me. I appreciate it. Bless you. And you know what? I spent six hours in the woods. Can't think of a better place to be. Bless you. I'll talk to you later.